In this Python tutorial, we will make a desktop application with column elements using the PY Simple GUI library. There are two column elements in the application. After entering the values into the input objects, when you press the button, the entered values are displayed in the text objects. I will show you step by step how to do the application. To support us, do not forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video. So let's start. I created an empty desktop window. First, I create a text object. The parameter sent to the text function represents the name of the object. I'm creating a list. I add the text object to the list. I add a column object to the layout list. I send the list I created to the columns object. I added the text object to the desktop window. I can now add all the objects I created for the first column to the list. I create three input objects. I add all three input objects to the list I created for the first column. Input objects have been added to the desktop window. Now I will add a button. I can create buttons with the button function. I add the object to the list. Button object has been added to the desktop window. I will add a result text object to the desktop window. When the button is pressed, the values entered into the input object will be displayed in this text object. I add the object to the list. The text object has been added to the desktop window. I need to access input objects. I define separate keys for each input object. I define a key for the button. I define a key for the output text object. I will access objects using these keys. As you can see, when the button is clicked, the entered values along with the keys appear in the list. Now let's create the second column. I copy all the objects I created for the first column. I edit the variables for text. I am editing for input objects. I'm making arrangements for the button. I am editing the output text object. I'm editing the column list. Finally, I add the list I created for the second column to the layout list. All the objects I created for the first and second columns were added to the desktop window. Now we will display the values entered in the input objects in the text objects when the button is clicked. If the first button is clicked, I will create three variables.
I access the first, second, and third input objects using keys. I change the text of the first output text with the update function. Notice where we define the keys. I enter values into the input objects in the first column. When you click on the button, the values are displayed in the text object. Let's do the same for the second column. I'm copying and pasting. I am making the necessary arrangements. There are two column elements in the application. After entering the values into the input objects, when you press the button, the entered values are displayed in the text objects. In this video, we learned how to use the column element. To support us, do not forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video.